There was a very interesting book that came out a couple of years ago called The History of the World in Six Glasses. And it looked at the various drinks that were consumed by people over history, starting with beer in Mesopotamia. Beer is actually the oldest man-made drink that, uh, that we have. Wine was the second of these special drinks that had such an impact on history. And in the book, it looks at the use of wines by the Greeks. The Greeks were the ones that at that point in history, in the Mediterranean area, the Greeks were the dominant military and intellectual power of its day. And the Greeks had a very high regard, a very high respect for the use of wine and the use of this as part of their society. In fact, you may have heard of an event, in fact, we still have them today, in which people, they, they call them symposia or symposiums. And a symposium in our society is when people just kind of get together and talk about serious top topics. Well, the term was originally coined by the Greeks and it had a very special meaning. A symposium was where the men of the society got together and discussed the great issues of the day, the great topics of life, such as what is the meaning of life? Why are we here? Why are we living on this world? What is the future of this world? And they had these meetings. The liquid they would serve at them was wine. Wine was used in that circumstance to basically stimulate conversation. They discovered that conversation of these great thoughts seemed to get better when they had a little bit of lubricants from wine. 